Launched on Thanksgiving Day 1917, the Lucy Evelyn was a lifelong dream of Captain Everett C. Lindsay. The ship was named after Captain Lindsay's two daughters, Lucy and Evelyn. Fully rigged and ready to sail in January 1918, an unforeseen freeze locked her into the harbor. It was one of the most severe winters in history. With the spring thaw, she sailed with a cargo of coal for New York and Santa Domingo and returned to New York loaded with molasses. The Lucy Evelyn was a windjammer and had no auxiliary power. One time off of Cape Cod, she sprang a leak and quickly filled with water. Only her cargo kept her afloat. She drifted helplessly for three days until a Coast Guard patrol towed her ashore for repairs. She sprang another leak in January 1948. The crew had to move 60 tons of rock ballast by hand to raise the front of the ship. She was unable to pick up cargo for months. When they docked to New Bedford, the seamen sued for back pay and the Lucy Evelyn was put up for auction. The ship was sold for $1,500 and towed to Beach Haven where she was turned into a gift shop. The C. Chess Gift Shop first opened on Memorial Day 1937 and was located on the Beach Haven boardwalk but washed away during the hurricane of 1944. The Lucy Evelyn sat aground on a sand barrier in the Barnegat Bay for months until a violent nor'easter raged and the tide rose and kept rising. With the help of two local draggers, two Coast Guard patrol boats, and a 50-foot dragger called the Black Whale, lines were made and the pull began. She would not budge. Using an anchor and a winch, and after an hour of tension, she was finally free. A 14-foot deep basin was dug, and another high tide enabled the Lucy Evelyn to float into the basin. Two bulldozers eased her into her final location. Modifications were made in time to open for Memorial Day 1949. An entrance door was cut into the starboard side. Small shops were built, like the Shell Shanty, filled with shells, starfish, nets, and other treasures from the sea. This building still remains today. It was turned 90 degrees, but still sits in the same location. A narrow boardwalk with rope railings connected the small shops. Anchors and rowboats decorated the sandy ground. There was a Christmas shop called Christmas Cargo. It was filled with nautical ornaments. During the winter of 1972, work was being done on the Lucy Evelyn when a kerosene heater ignited the years of pitch. Despite valiant efforts by firemen, the Lucy Evelyn was gone. All that was left were the memories, when kids played on her deck and imagined they were sailing out at sea, families shopping in her hull. Memories of driftwood and long oars hanging from the beams to act as display fixtures. Mahogany ship steering wheels that were made into lighting fixtures. Hatches that were converted into skylights to let the light into the Lucy Evelyn. It was a wonderful place to visit. Now when you visit Schooner's Wharf, the Tivoli stands to remind you of the Lucy Evelyn. For more information on the Lucy Evelyn, please visit the New Jersey Maritime Museum on Dock Road in Beach Haven.